Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Melanie here. I just got done getting ready to leave for a gig and I realized I had some time, so I thought I'd do a quick little what's in my bag video for you before I head out. So, this is what is in my Louis Vuitton Vito in the MM size. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. I will show you how I pack it and what fits in here. So if you're looking into this bag or have this bag and want some ideas of how to pack it and what fits for you, then um, hopefully you will find this helpful. As you can see, I like to keep my bag pretty organized. I do have an insert in here um, to start off. I'll tell you that this insert is the one that I actually use for my toiletry 26 and it fits nicely in here to give me more room to put stuff on the inside like on the side pockets as well. So I will put the link to this for you in the description below so you can find it for yourself. So we'll start with the first two slip pockets. It has the, the two slip pockets right here and in this side I like to keep my prescription glasses some sunglasses and then on this side I like to keep my phone and I have a Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge and um, that fits perfectly in there here's the case for size reference and you can fit a much bigger phone in here as well because the pocket is pretty big so hopefully you can see that the lighting is a little dark because it is nighttime right now as I said I'm getting ready to go and sing here in a minute and then off to the side I have another glasses case. This has my prescription sunglasses in there. I like to keep that there. And then tucked on this side right here, I keep a little water bottle. Okay, next we'll move to the back pouch. There's one big slip pocket in the back. And in here, I ha like to keep my keys. I have little key bracelet rings. I love this. It makes it really easy for me to have access to my keys. So I keep those back there. I keep a clippa so I can hang my purse up without it touching the ground. Then I also keep a scrunchie or sometimes some rubber bands. So that all fits in there nicely. It's a really big slip pocket. And then next to that slip pocket, I keep my little Neverfull pouch in here just in case if I want to run out really quick and do something and not carry this whole bag with me, then that slips nicely in there. And then right here on the inside, next to the insert, I keep a little pouch. You can keep something like cosmetics or, you know, extra little things that you might need. And here I keep an external charger battery and a cord and a plug in case I need that. And next in the insert, I like to keep a key pouch and I keep extra change in here and cards that I might need. And then I have my compact Zoe wallet. You can fit a bigger wallet in there as well. And then I also have my mini pochette, which I like to keep in all of my bags if they fit, unless I just have a little clutch or something that I'm using. But this fits in almost all of my bags. And in here I keep compact, lip products, mints, I have a perfume roller down in there, some band-aids, um, tampons, all of my everyday essentials that I'm going to need that I need in all my bags, I like to keep in there. And that fits nicely down in there. Let me show you just how big the insert is, right here, you can see. Like I said, this fits in the Toiletry 26, and I like it, I like how it fits inside this bag because it's a nice height to where when I stand it up in there, it's not in the way of the zipper, but yet it still has organization for me, and it gives me plenty of room to add other things in there, so this bag can hold quite... A big amount of things in it so as you can see all this stuff right here everything that can fit in this bag and it can also fit a lot more this is just how I pack my bag I don't like to overstuff my bag with things so if you are somebody that is concerned about being able to carry more you can carry more in here and um, I guess I could show you that but I do want to show you the feature of this hidden zipper so that's what we'll do next so one of the main things I did want to show you about the bag is this hidden zipper pocket that it has right here. I love this feature because you can put so many things in here. Um, right now I have the little luggage tag. This bag does come with this luggage tag, but I like the way it looks without it. So take that out of there. But it's really roomy. It goes all the way down to the bottom here and up here. 
And if you're wondering if this pocket can fit a phone, like I said, I have the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. Technically, yes, you can fit this all the way down in there. You have to kind of push it in because the way it's shaped like a triangle. So you can put it in there and it will zip all the way up. But I find that just a little too, I don't know. I don't like, I just don't like the way it fits. But you can, if you have a phone like this or smaller, it will fit in there. Anything bigger than this will not fit in that pocket. But some other things you could use it for, you could stick your keys in there. Like I said, I have this big bracelet key thing. This can fit down in there nicely, and it zips up nice. You can fit your key pouch in there nicely. Plenty of room. If you have a wallet, um, this is the Zoe wallet, like I said. It fits nicely in there. Um, I think you could probably fit a bigger, bigger wallet in there. Maybe the Victorine would probably fit in there if you have that. But that fits nicely in there. You can fit some sunglasses down in there, or glasses. So just to give you an idea of what that pocket holds. So here's a mod shot of me holding the bag. I'm 5 feet 5 inches tall. And when I extend my arm all the way holding it by the top handle, the strap does not hit the ground. Works really great in the crook of the arm. I really enjoy wearing this as a crossbody. It's not too heavy and it doesn't bother my shoulders or anything like that. I like where it hits right here on my hip. It gives me easy access to everything. And I have it set on the shortest part of the strap. It is adjustable, so if you are taller than me, you have plenty of room to work with on this strap. And I love how the strap and the handles on this bag are treated leather, so you don't have to worry about babying this bag. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it or that you found it helpful if you're interested in this bag. And as always, please feel free to click like and click subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Okay, well, I am off to go sing some tunes, so I will see you next time.